is James Bay. Well, if PowerPoint decks could stop a pandemic, this government would be the world champion in preventative health. And I'm not saying that to be flipped, but two months into this crisis, isolated First Nations are waiting for the basics like hand sanitizers and gloves and masks, let alone ventilators. If COVID-19 hits a community like Bearskin Lake or Kashechuan, we're in the nightmare scenario because how do you self-isolate in a home of 21 people full of mold? And so the minister's plan is to bring in tents. What, in James Bay in March? That ain't gonna cut it. When are we gonna see a sense of urgency to protect the lives of First Nation people? Here, here. The Honourable Minister. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and I want to thank the member opposite for attending the technical briefing this morning with my staff. The funding announced yesterday as part of the Budget 2019 emergency investments is a start that enables us to take immediate action in communities to reduce the risk of spread, as well as to respond should cases arrive on reserve. These the reinforces the support for Indigenous communities are not limited by financial capacities and we're working closely to coordinate those resources with communities. We're providing supplies such as bottled water, uh, hand sanitizer, personal protective equipment to communities as needed. We'll continue to work with our partners to ensure that Indigenous communities are prepared to respond to COVID-19 and we'll continue to adapt. Our plan as needed. Good job,